Okay, seeing as how I promised you I would give you base deluxe if the demand was high, well, here it is. Might as well get this fight over with. So yeah, as you can see, he has 2,000 HP, same as usual, but has 150 life aura. In other words, most of my attacks won't be able to do jack shit to it, unfortunately. So I'll just have to do my best with what I got. I'll put a time bomb over there, just to take out that aura. What I decide to attack him with, well, that's fair game. I believe a Vara Sword would be a perfect candidate. Oh, I screwed it up! I usually don't screw that up. But of course I have to at this particular time. There, let me put in a mine in a random spot. Seeing as how he likes to move around, he should be able to trigger it. Like that. Okay, let's try another bar sword. This time it better work. It did. Okay, let me try something else. Uh, attack 30, attack 20. Let me get rid of the Recub 150, because I want to finish this fight as soon as possible, therefore I won't be needing any recovery. I, at least I hope not. And this is not going to do me any good either, so that can go. I'm going to need better chips than this. Okay, let me go with Var Sword L. That should help a little bit, and I didn't even see him! That set me up for disaster. There, good thing I had an Invis 3. Okay, I almost got my Gator fo folder ready, or my Gator combo. I only got like a one of each, so it's not going to be a huge Gator setup that I'm accustomed to. Because Gator will not be much help unless the aura is already down. That's why I need a little mix of the two. Um, let me see. Uh, let me try the Cuss Sword. It might work. But I have to do this at the right time. And he was too far and wouldn't be working anyway. It's very unfortunate. I only need one area grab, so let me just add from this one. Oh man, I'm in trouble pretty much. Uh, actually, this will work in my favor, but then again, if I use the Life Sword 3, I'll end up destroying the barrier and not do any damage. So with that in mind, let me get rid of these now. I'm just going on the fly. Hopefully, I'll get a miracle. Uh, let's go with area grab and fire aqua elec, and then I can set up Gator on my next turn. I just hope it'll be enough. Just have to use the life sword three at the last second. Yeah, well, I have plenty of time to use it. Like right now! Wind Fan Gate Man. Okay, so I only get to use Gator once. I better make a count. So let's go for it. And now the rest... It's all up to fate. Dear God, I better have some good fate. Uh, let's see, uh, what would be a good idea? Could use some Meteor 18s. I'll save that for, like, the end. Like, right now. Hopefully at least one of those Meteors connects, and he hit the wand! He hit the fucking wand! Ouch! Ooh. 
Now I'm in big trouble. I have to go by desperation. I'll have to use the Proto Man V2 first. What? Fine, I'll use the Proto Man V3 then. At least that connects. Oh, and I just wore out. So in other words, I have to use Toe Man to destroy the aura, and then use Shadow Man to finish him off. In other words, there's a lot of pressure for this move to work. And, yeah, it should do enough damage. So, that was probably the worst effort ever against Base Deluxe that still managed to be a win. Yeah, if you do better, you can get Base 2 or Base 3, and even Life Aura 3. But I can care less. Now, it wasn't the best folder, but I still managed to win. Made some errors. But yet, I still got Base Deluxe defeated. And I'm not trying again just to get more chips. Forget it. Goodbye, everyone.